All right. Hello, everyone. This uh, is a little channel update. I usually um, do this without any music, but I I have something to show you. So this is the background music of the game. So just if you know, it's a bit not, if you don't know, you'll get it in just a few minutes. So like I said, this is a channel update. Now, this channel update is just happening because I'm still using the new format of our videos in that we go from one week is one series, second week is another series, and it goes back and forth. Different series each week, but it's only two series for right now. I don't think I'm going to do more than that, but right now we're doing two. So, what's going to happen is uh, I'm just going to do for the first couple of this, I'm going to do a channel update when the series changes. So just to remind people. So right now, next uh, starting tomorrow, because this is going to be released on Monday, uh, the 29th of April, starting tomorrow on the 30th, we'll be switching back from uh, Planet Crafter to War of the Walkers and going through that. Now, I was really worried about how to get back into War of the Walkers because it's been, for me, like two, two and a half, three weeks since I last played it. But it, it all came back okay. Uh, we weren't, we probably weren't doing what we were doing before, but I do like the new direction that it's going if we aren't doing what we were doing before. So, yeah. We'll just, uh, I, I, by the end of it, I felt like I was in a good place to continue on with what we were doing in War of the Walkers and things like that. So I just wanted to let you know, the first couple of episodes are going to be a little rough because I was trying to remember what we were doing and things like that. But eventually it just smooths out and we go and we get things done. Uh, a lot, I will say there's going to be a lot of mining and things. So if you want to skip past that, you may want to skip a couple of episodes, but um, we need to get you know, we need to get things to make gunpowder and things like that, nitrate, all that stuff for farm plots, because we expanded our farm finally and got that running. So just look forward to that. That's coming starting tomorrow, the 30th. Um, another thing happening on April 30th is the uh, new limited banner in Ark Knights. So expect that tomorrow as well. I'll be doing a banner pulls on that. I'm really hoping to get Vivian. I'm, I, I always get every character, but the one I want the most is Vivian, even though she's not meta. I just love her aesthetic and what and everything like that. She's not I'm going to raise her as an operator, but I doubt I hardly ever be using her because she's really bad as an operator. But I do like her aesthetic. I like her character. I like her story. So I will be making her and getting her going. So now as another thing, uh, future plans for series. I do have future plan for right now. This is not a guarantee. This is what's going to happen, but this is what I'm thinking of. So, you know me, I played Tiaria. If you know the music, you're hearing music right now. It's Tiaria music, but a little bit different. So I was thinking about it and I've been testing it out and I'm going to show you. Welcome to Calamity. Now, this is going to be a little bit different. You're probably not going, if you're a hardcore Tiaria Calamity person, you're probably not going to like the series because I'm not going to do it like you would regularly see a Tiaria Calamity series. We're going to be still in journey mode, but what I'm going to do in the journey mode is I'm not going to copy anything except for my starting gear. That way, if something happens, I lose it somehow or something, I can get it back but there's going to be no copying of ores. There's going to be no copying of gold, platinum, all that stuff. The coin, the money, not the platinum ore, but the money. Because um, it makes it a little bit too easy, but I do want to play in journey mode. It's just a personal preference for mine. In case something goes wrong, I like having the ability to do something in it. So I will be playing in journey mode, but we will be turning it on to expert and we will be turning on Revengeance Mode, the easiest difficulty of um, Calamity, basically. So I wanted to show you, I like I said, I've been doing a little testing. Um, let's get back, let's get in here and I'll show you um, what it is. So 
this is my little starting area here. Uh, like I said, I have um, Vengeance on. I am running a summoner build. So I am doing that. Um, let me throw these off in here. I have this stuff in me. Um, I am still in pre-hard mode. These are the only bosses I've killed so far. These are... Um... Oh, she's healing people. I was wondering what she was doing. She's healing people. Okay. So this is... Uh, we killed Slime King first. We killed Eye of Cthulhu next. The... Um... The, actually, the, I killed the Hive Mind, which is a new boss in Calamity Mod, in the Corruption first, and then I killed uh, the Worm, and then I killed Skeleton, and then I killed um, the Queen Bee to get the gear and stuff like that. But this is uh, my little starting area. I made this little thing for these people. Um... I had people over here, but this is kind of just a temporary storage thing. I'm, I would eventually remove this if I was going to continue this. This is kind of just a preview of my world. Here is my elevator right here that I used the mod for. Uh, these are extra um, houses for NPCs. Um, I had this little uh, kind of bridge type thing to go up to Sky Islands early. So I could uh, get over here. I used uh, like um, like a Star Fury early on as a weapon. So that's why I came up here to see if I could get one. Um, and we have like the, MP the Alchemist NPC lights, the Far Grace Mutant Mod NPCs in here is what some of these are. Um, I have uh, the mod No Pylon Restrictions. We're going to have that going on if we do this series. Uh, there is another Sky Island over here. I was just using it for fishing because it's a fishing deal and things like that. Um, and this is my little arena I have set up here. Um, I think in the future, I did something different. Let me show you. I do have the... Um, I still don't know where this comes from, but you can turn it off if you want to. The teleporting with right clicking whenever you want to but i um i did this differently down here uh for whatever reason the quality of tiaria mod which is its name it used to be quality of life tiaria i think it's now just quality of tiaria mod it has an option for the lava slimes when you're in expert difficulty or more they will release lava when you kill them and it will destroy platforms, any type of platform you put. Um, especially the easy wood ones, which is what the, um, the um, they're in here somewhere, the instant bridges, instant mini bridges. I don't know where they are off the top of my head. Um, do I have them on me somewhere? Maybe not. I'll look in them real quick. Let's see. Um, this one, the mini instant bridge, it creates the platforms you saw up in the air. So I was, uh, I did this one different. This one I did by using the, what is known as the space wand. And what the space wand does is you can, um, well, I used that wrong. Uh, what I need to do is, it was, uh, we're supposed to, oh, I was wondering why this isn't working. My keybinds are wrong. It can't be me without having wrong keybinds here. It's just not possible. All right. So now I should be able to right click and this allows me to change things. And I just chose the planter boxes and that's what I did. Uh, what you do with the um, deals, I have platforms right now, so I'll just show you. You can just like um, do this and just make these. And you can do this with anything that the wand accepts. So I did it with the planter boxes, the day, the day bloom planter boxes. I just drew them all along. 
and it goes a pretty long way. It doesn't expand the whole area. It goes up to here and then um, all the way over to here. Uh, it doesn't go all the way around, but it's enough for the wall of flesh, I feel, for um, here. I haven't killed wall of flesh. I'm not going to. I just wanted to. I just wanted to set this up in case I did want to get to that point. Um, but yeah, there is. Um, that's what I've done there. Uh, I have other things. I have a fishing deal for pretty much every biome. Um, I have people in the snow biome here. Um, I have people over here in the this other. Uh, regular foresty area. I have people in the desert here. I cleared the dungeon. This was my dungeon layout. I got a fishing deal here. Uh, this is a new area. This is abated by Calamity. I'm not sure if you like fought a boss in here later or something, but yeah, that's where that is. Um, I haven't gone and explored the Sulfic Sea at all. It's over here. Um, we can clear the acid rain if we wanted to, but I'm not interested in doing that right now. Um, but yeah, there's the acid rain going on right now. That's from Calamity. In the jungle, I have people set up for the jungle stuff. Uh, down here is my uh, goblin and the, and the mechanic down there. I have people over here. This is like this is Peter. This is not the uh, steampunker. This is uh, uh, she is the sister apparently of the steampunker. She's a tinkerer. She gives you like tink the accessories and stuff. Um, this is why arena. This is a, a big ass arena. I think this is just added from Calamity mod. It's got chest off in it and everything that you can do things with uh also these things spawn they they are geodes and things uh this apparently just is gets a gets you a scuttler that gives you uh that's a pet and things like that if you wish to um uh and things like that um but yeah this is where i killed the queen bee and things it's a really nice big one i i'm wondering if this is See, I chose the, I've never played on it, but I chose the large world. I wonder if this is a because of the large world or if this is because of the calamity. I don't know. I also found the um, the temple here. And also there was chest and things. I could grab things. Unfortunately, there was solar tablets, but there was just enough not to have 10 of them so I could have infinite of the fragments. So you need um, you need uh, ten solar fragments to get infinite of them, and then I could have solar events uh, before hard mode. But I don't think I I can I can't get more. So also uh, this is a different um, mod than usual. This is the uh, angler angler shop. But it's not the regular angler shop. It's one based off of it that does other things. It actually kind of locks the progression of some things until you kill certain bosses. So it's not that bad, actually. It, like, I, I haven't killed Water Flesh, but I can still buy, like, the golden bug net, the golden fishing rod, and things like that. I can still buy the stuff, and I haven't killed Water Flesh. Yet. So it's not that bad, really. Um, the dyer is here and things like that. Um, there is um, these guys here as well. The logger and the um, person who sells the uh, ball summons, I think is what these are. Or the... Um, these are the, um, the summons for things that... Um, like wondering I fish turn me Berman, so not really ball summons, more about the uh, the uh, other rare mob summons. Oh, I need to right click it so I can that just takes me here. And that spawn and there that'll take me down. I was, I had that thing wrong. Um 
I also have a mod that lets me start with a starter bag for things and it has various starter bags depending on which mod you have and when you have um, um, uh, magic storage installed it gives you this all this stuff here I have you get just the basic storage deals I have upgraded them from from basic to demon knight to hellstone that's why they have hellstone on them they actually start as basic item uh, deals and I like I said I've been playing and testing things out I've been using the um, journey mode system to test things out and things like that but um, I wouldn't be doing that like I said I wouldn't be doing that if we started an actual series in uh, deals I would be just um, researching the starting gear I start with and probably wooden armor only and then it goes from then I just don't research anything else at all. Uh, I wouldn't research like po I wouldn't research potions. I wouldn't research the herbal garden, uh, the the day bloom and things like that or anything really. Um, all right. Well, I've been rambling a little bit too long for this. Let's just supposed to be just an update video, but I just wanted y'all to see this is what I'm thinking about. I don't know for sure if this is going to be what the next series is. This would start when, if this series started, it would start when the War of the Walker series ended, which is still going to be a little while longer because I am really still enjoying it when I was playing it. So we'll see how it goes. But this is what I'm thinking the next series is going to be. I'm not a hundred, a totally 100% sure of that, but this is what I'm leaning towards. Something else might come along and grab my attention instead. So just want to give y'all a quick update there on that. So I want to thank everybody for watching. I'll see y'all next time. Y'all have a nice time, whatever time it is in y'all's part of the world. Bye.